this is probably uh, no doubt the largest kind of project that the uh, art museum has undertaken since being in this building. The city of El Paso has stepped in and really uh, allowed us to address some very important aspects that needed to be addressed. Um, of course, the renovation of the entire space with new wood flooring. We've also made upgrades to our roof to ensure that everything that's being offered here on display always is preserved properly. This refresh exhibition, of course, um, exists Latin American art, which is an important aspect of our permanent collection. We have also included in this refresh early Texas art. As you see, we've added uh, more divisions between the galleries so that uh, the kind of seamless uh, transition from one gallery into another becomes something that makes sense thematically. We have included contemporary art as well as American art. For the first time ever here at the El Paso Museum of Art, we've been able to also devote uh, an entire exhibition thematically to works on paper. In our hunt galleries, we will be able to present uh, an installation that focuses on really the celebration of the support that the community has shown to the El Paso Museum of Art by donating uh, important collections, collections that have really characterized and defined in many ways what the El Paso Museum of Art holds. We have the Samuel H. Crest collection, for example, that was also re reinstalled uh, in, uh, within the last uh, year or year and a half. So that entire space is, is open to visitors. It is really an entirely new exhibition, uh, reconceptualized, re-envisioned um, and, and it's a very engaging, engaging space now for visitors who are coming in.